Gallbladder cancer is one of the major cancer which is uh, causing lot of morbidity in patients. The disadvantage with gallbladder cancer is majority of these patients come in very advanced late stage. Incidence of gallbladder cancer is around 21,000 to around 30,000 patients, uh, new patients every year. Uh, gallbladder cancer is one of the common cancer affecting uh, population in the northern India because the incidence of gallstones is very high in northern India. Gallbladder cancer unfortunately presents in very advanced stage most of the time because this usually does not cause pain in the early stage and there is ample space to grow this cancer in the abdominal cavity so that disease keep on growing inside the abdomen and by the time it causes symptoms it is too late. So nowadays we are coming with lot of patients who are having very advanced disease and majority in stage 4 of the disease. The common causes of can gallbladder cancer are uh, most and most common one is gallstones which is due to constant irritation of the gallbladder wall causes uh, development of cancer. Then some infections also causes uh, gallbladder cancer and regular intake of alcohol is one of the risk factor for gallbladder cancer. Gallbladder cancer is investigated using uh, ultrasonography, CT scan, then if required uh, maybe whole body PET CT scan. Uh, whenever it is detected, the next step is to go for whether it is uh, to decide whether it is operable or not. The mainstay of treatment in early stage of gallbladder cancer is surgery. And I would like to emphasize here that surgery is the only curative treatment possible in gallbladder cancer. No other modality gives curative treatment possibility. So in gallbladder cancer surgery, so first and foremost, uh, we do the procedure called radical cholecystectomy along with periportal lymph node dissection. Here we remove the periportal lymph nodes, all the lymph nodes along the portal system as well as uh, hepatic uh, and gastric artery area uh, along the lymph nodes in the celiac axis also. And then we remove the gallbladder uh, end block with the adherent liver tissue that is segment 4 and uh, 5 liver tissue. So this is taken end block and uh, again whenever we do this surgery we do the frozen section of the cystic duct stump to see whether disease is completely removed or not. If there is a disease in the cystic stump, then we may have to do a, a still extended surgery to remove the cystic duct as well as uh, common bile duct most of the times. However, that depends on the patient's general condition. The common symptoms where patients come are with anorexia and uh, loss of weight because most of these patients, nearly 70% of these patients come with uh, jaundice and advanced disease causing loss of weight, loss of appetite. And some patients may present with the uh, gastric outlet obstruction due to duodenal obstruction due to uh, tumor infiltrating the duodenum or even uh, part of the uh, stomach also. Then other common uh, presentation may be involvement of colon causing obstruction and patient may come with obstru intestinal obstruction. And uh, after the surgery patient will require radiotherapy to the gallbladder bed and uh, the patient may require chemotherapy to give a complete uh, control and uh, with all the three modalities the results are quite good if detected early otherwise the outcome with gallbladder cancer is not very good gallbladder cancer as well as pancreatic cancer are a few of the very aggressive cancers in the abdominal cavity so how to prevent this uh, to prevent gallbladder cancer one should avoid consuming alcohol and uh, live a better life with the exercise and all. Then getting even there is asymptomatic gallstones, one should always go for uh, cholecystectomy because if re left for long term, gallstones can cause uh, cancer development in these patients.